asked, I asked, I asked, I said, tap I said, you want to, you like documentaries? I suggest there's a, a documentary on Hulu called Batman and Bill. And you know, you're not a big Batman. I'm like, not person, a huge Batman fan. Person. No, I love documentaries. So I know, documentaries. I know the Batman comics. I know some of its history. I watched, you know, the original Batman stuff yeah. and. Um, I, said, I said, watch Batman and Bill. I think you might like this story. I really overall, loved the story. Overall, what did you think about this story? Yeah. The story was sad. That's what I overall thought. So it's, it's, it's a situation where the person, Bob Kane, who was always credited for being the creator of ba of Batman, technically, yes, he created Batman. person got taken advantage of so vehemently throughout the entire person got taken advantage of so vehemently throughout the entire documentary and you 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 got to watch it happen and it was sad and he just so genuinely wanted to participate that he never really considered how him not advocating for himself affected him down the line yeah. and that was the really sad part and his it, legacy and yeah. his legacy mm -hmm. and then of course with his son and then like yeah. just all and i don't want to give too much away if you haven't seen it because it really is a good documentary yeah. like i genuinely enjoyed it yeah. um it's just they, there's you know the ending is is that you know i wish everyone kind of knows that the ending is going to happen the way it does but you know he finally gets credit on all future things but I felt like that that was just still a disappointment in what could have been done. What this this company could have done and how they could have elevated this, in my mind, yeah. major mistake. Yeah. If, if the company the company wanted to, they could have corrected this problem a, a long, long time, time ago, ago, but they didn't took, want to. It took one guy who Ooh, was not related to them at, in any way, shape, or form. You want to talk about some hyperfixation? Yeah. That man had the longest running it, ADD <laughs> hyperfixation I have ever seen in my entire life. If he didn't do what he did, Bill Finger's granddaughter uh, uh, grand, uh, would, ne never. Would, would never... She would have not yeah. known so much. She would no, She would have known, no, no, but she, she would not have had the... the no, she would have not. He taught her things about her own family that she didn't know. Oh, yeah, yeah, that, that, yeah. Wonderfully, and the guy's so passionate that you kind of get pulled into his own... You get pulled into his passion of the creator of Batman, yeah, which is really up. interesting yeah. because you're like, oh, my God, I am so on this right. road with yeah. you. <laughs> if, uh, which is why I felt like if even if, if you're not a comic book fan or a Batman fan or anything... His passion, you're 100% you're right. It, it pulls you in. It you don't need addicting. to be a comic big, yes. big person to be pulled into the, the sense of just like, this is wrong and correct. we need to correct this and kind of situation. You know, they made a, in the documentary, they made a really good point. You know, the fact that he, who is a fan of Batman and the concept of Batman, the concept of creating justice from a normal person, because Batman is not a superhero he does mm. in the sense that he has a superpower he is a normal person who uses things to create no, that his, super his accent. money makes him super no 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 he doesn't have a superpower like he doesn't have some sort of external thing creating him to be better than the rest it's beyond money like a an, billion a, a, dollars anywho <laughs> <laughs> a billion dollars can only buy so much. Um, and so he, so he uses technology as his form of superpower. And so the concept of that is quite lifting to your normal person, your everyday person. Well, if a normal person can be Batman and can create justice out of this, then then a normal person can can find the person who created Batman. A normal person can create this scenario. Yeah. And you, you really see this young man with a family and his life this is his his life passion yeah it, and it, it, his life this is his his life passion yeah. what? that feels selfless that's a very rare yeah. thing to come across yeah. and this and that's out, probably why this was such a good doc because yeah, it was very selfless it felt very, very selfless. selfless there was so much of this guy's life dedicated yeah. to this so much of it this did not happen in a year yeah 